Hey there guys, I'm back on the farm. Let's go metal detecting. Hey there guys, you okay? Hope you're all alright out there. Um, so, I didn't expect to come back to the farm at all until like the autumn. Um, I'll keep it brief. Um, so I was expecting to just go to the beaches and stuff like that. I came up to the farm yesterday. Uh, I gave my farmer um, a, a present. I, I mounted the... I wish I took a picture now. I mounted the a medieval token which I found in one of his fields. Um, in one of those floating frames and I gave him some silver coins and he was absolutely over the moon with that and he said uh, you know what he's got two fields I can use um, I will be joined by cows at some point in the next couple of weeks but he wants to keep them uh, he cares a lot for his cows so he's like going to keep them all warm and with a heater on and stuff like that um, I turned up just now and he laughed his head off Yep, um, I was, it's predicted to have 90% rainfall today, So, but this is the only waterproofs I have. <laughs> but, you know, at least he had a laugh. So I've just, I've gone, I've just turned you around. So this is the two fields. Uh, he's let them overgrow deliberately for the cows. Uh, if you look down there, I don't know if you can see, there's a couple of deers. Sorry, the camera's not great couple of deers down there munching the grass at the moment they're too bothered by me and uh right so using the Nocta legend um i'm on multi two field mode if i've got that right i think i've not used it for so long the, that mode and uh, i've done a ground balancing and all the rest of it uh Recovery speed five. Oh, those deer are cool. They're only a little deer. Anyway, right. I'll see you at the first hole, if there is one. Right, I'm losing quite a lot of depth. So I turn sensitivity up and I'm... Hopefully the, the, the fines will be quite shallow. Because this grass is really long. Saying that... That looks like a coin. My first target. Which have dropped again. There it is. How about that? That's Elizabeth the second. That's a half crown. You hear that? Pheasants and wildlife everywhere in this place, which is cool. Yeah, Elizabeth second half crown. How about that's a cracking first find? How cool is that? Oh, happy days. Right, <clears throat> I did. Did I tell you? I, was, I don't know if I told you. I'm using multi frequency too on that. There you go. Got to tell you. Um, just found this. The clod that it was on has crumbled around me. Around it, you see it. Not entirely sure what it was. I just dropped it. Not sure what that is. I'm gonna get the brush on that because uh, I don't know. I'll get the brush and some water on it, and I'll be back. There we have it then, folks. I don't even know what that could have been. Interesting, anyway. Might have been a brooch at one point. There's nothing on the other side. You see the decoration around the edge? Might have been gold gilted at one point. I don't know. Interesting. Right, folks, I've uh, 
been battling my way through the long grass and not found an awful lot, a couple of iron bits, but I wasn't going to dig this. It sounded like a chunk of iron, but I'm glad I did. It looks like a, a nice button. How about that? Hmm. Don't know if there's anything on it. But hey, I'm happy to find that. Nice little button. Right, I've come down to the bottom part of the field. I'm not gridding it or anything, I'm just going randomly where I can get because it's proper like deep grass. I uh, come next to this stream, a couple of deer ran majestically off into the woods. Couldn't get the camera out in time though. And I found a coin. Let's hope it's a coin. Yeah, it's a coin. A bit grotty. Mm, it's a bit warm. Feels quite heavy. Maybe a, an older penny. Possibly Georgian. Hmm. See if I can clean it up later. But yeah, coin. Nice. Well, well, I'm going to stay out too much longer, guys. Uh, I've been out for a long time. I was just trying to battle my way through all this long grass. But, I'll stay out for a bit longer. Got a spoon. It's like a copper spoon. That is, there's some age to that. Probably would have had a wooden handle at some point. But yeah. Ah, Blooming Depot. Just uh, frightened the rabbit actually. It just darted right in front of me. <laughs> Little buggers. And a horseshoe. I don't mind finding these as long as they're complete. Got a bit of a collection of these now in the garden, so uh, yeah, that'll join the rest. I will clean them up one day. That's cool, I like that. Someone lose a key? But that really annoyed someone back in the day when they, when they lost it. Oh, just walking through the top field uh, on the way home. And this, I'm not sure exactly what it is just yet. <laughs> that wasn't it, that's it. Oh, right. I was looking at the wrong thing. It's a coin. How about that? <laughs> Can't believe it. I just saw the a little bit of mud where well, you saw it as well, but <laughs> I'm feeling a little tired and a bit, a bit stupid now. It's definitely a penny. I'll, I'll give this a quick brush and I'll uh, I'll get back to you. Yep, yeah, it's a. Uh, even by the top of the head there. I mean, I'd be able to clean this off probably a little more careful. But uh, there, that's an Edward the Seventh penny. That's actually really cool. Happy with that. Right, that's the end of a difficult day. Been here quite a few hours. Uh, to you guys, it seems just a few minutes probably. The conditions are quite tough, but I'm uh, looking forward to coming back. There is some signs of life here, some coins. So I bet there's more stuff here. Uh, I am expecting the cows on here at some point, so that would be interesting. <laughs> so I'm just going to go home and clean up this, uh, this stuff. And uh, I shall talk to you in a sec. Right folks, we're back home. Uh, I've just cleaned up everything, uh, apart from the horseshoe, I'll uh, 
put a wire brush on that at some point. But I've got so many horseshoes to clean up, it's crazy. Right, we've got a, a copper spoon here. Uh, find these quite a bit on that farm. Um, suspect it might have been used around Civil War sort of time. Maybe, I don't know. It probably would have had a wooden handle at some point. Um, but yeah, we'll find quite a lot of those. Uh, there's the key. Nothing amazing. I did. There's some bits I didn't film because I didn't think, you know, what's the point? Um, yeah, probably a light fitting of some description. I'll go in the bin. Don't know, some kind of a lock or part of a lock. Uh, farm visit wouldn't be a, a farm hunt wouldn't be the same without a bit of lead, so that would go in the melting pot. Uh, yeah, blob of lead with some iron going through it, probably junk. Um, another couple of bits of junk there. Another one, of, a blob of another blob of lead with iron in it. Not even sure what that is. It's obviously snapped off some in. And a few other random bits of rubbish. Uh, then we got these um, coins. Cooper nickel, half crown. Queen Elizabeth II. Which is kind of cool. Uh, you got oh, this button here. It obviously had something on. Sorry about the budgies. But yeah, button. And a, a penny. Is this the. Uh, I suspected this was. I um, know, oh no, I don't know about that one. It's too worn, but it's a penny size anyway. It's quite chunky. So I'm. I'm gonna have a stab and just say it was uh, George III because I find quite a lot of those on that farm. Uh, this one here, I could just see the top of a head and I've put it down to Edward the Seventh Penny. That's kind of cool. And then there's this item. Still have no clear what it is. It's probably a button, was a button at some point. Yeah, yeah. some fancy around the edge there. Oh, anyway, so yeah, just a, a, a few hours out today uh, on these new fields. Um, I hope to go back again at some point. There will be cows on it, so um, yeah, I'll have those to deal with as well. But thanks for joining me. Thanks for getting to the end. I appreciate all of you for all of your support. Thank you very much for all of your support thus far, and I hope to see you all again soon. Please give the video a thumbs up, and I shall see you on the next.